How's it going everybody? Welcome back to part two, episode two, whatever you want to call it, of Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu. Today, or in this episode, because there's going to be multiples of these coming out every single day, we're going to go ahead and uh, make our way to Viridian, I guess. Uh, this kid up here uh, spoke to me last episode, I think I actually cut it out, um, but he said last time that he's going to bring his favorite Pokemon and that he wants to, uh, he wants to battle us. So this is our first ever battle, I believe this is probably Joey. I'm assuming this is Joey. This is our first battle outside of our rival battle. Uh, it's youngster Ronnie. What did you do with Joey? Where's Joey? Oh, man. What did they do with Joey, man? All right, I guess, I mean, I guess all I really can do is, is, is hit him with a double kick. And the Joy-Con rumbles whenever you actually like hit an attack. And I think, I think it rumbles quite hard if it's a super effective attack, which makes sense. Uh, so, you know, that's pretty dope, I guess. Poor, poor Ronnie's distraught because we, completely um, destroyed his his child, but it's fine uh, because we won and we're going to move forward. Hey, Viridian City, what's going on? Huh? You got, look pretty pleased about something, Callum. Oh, you beat another trainer? Good job. Well, since we're on the topic, the Pokemon you sent into battle might have lost some HP or PP. You should take them to the Pokemon Center and get them healed up. It doesn't cost money. It doesn't take long at all either. Just remember, heal up after battles. Hey, man. Really, really appreciate that. The way they walk out, walk away is pretty, is pr pretty funny. But I uh, really do appreciate it. Um, what's the what's the little little I'm trying to figure out what the little uh, the little icon down at the, the bottom right is? Uh, I think it's is it the is it the friend thing? I don't know. Anyways, let's let's now talk to Nurse Joy now that she's actually taking patience. Make your Pokemon for a few seconds. Pikachu just jumps straight up. Okay, so it does actually go into the ball. I was like, does Pikachu like get taken into like? Into care or something, or what's going on? Okay, so they, they, they just all get the same treatment. Cool. Well, um, actually, wait, hold on. I can go into my bag and change my outfit, huh? Let's let's get a proper look at that, because last episode from the big sister of our arrival, we got, um... I think we got clothes. We, we got sports gear. So, uh, choose an outfit for syrup. Yeah, sure, why not? Uh, hats. Sports cap. Yeah, you can have that. Why not, syrup? Sure. Why, why not? Clothes. Sportswear. Sure, why not? Everybody's gonna be doing this most likely uh, Outfit for Callum. I've just got the same stuff. So yeah, okay Well syrup's dressed up like me now, which of course is cute, but it's kind of creepy as to how the sister Got that exactly um, I think maybe the thing at the bottom right is that maybe for a two-player mode or something. I don't know. Whatever. Hey Those Pokeballs you got uh, you don't have any Pokemon. Do you uh, it's great that you carry and use your Pokemon anyway? Okay uh, I completely read what he said wrong. What did you say again? You have Pokemon, don't you? Okay, I thought, what do you mean I don't have any Pokemon? I literally have a Pikachu on my on my shoulder. Uh, sorry, not not the best at reading. That is something you will come to realize uh, on the Hoodlum Scrafty channel, but it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Hey, uh, I would like to buy some more Pokeballs, please, because I am actually running low. Uh, this is somewhere we're gonna come frequently. Um, let's just buy 20. Typically what I like to do is buy like 10 or 20. Do we get a Premier Ball? <gasps> you get two Premier Balls, they fixed it. Oh my god, for the longest time, you'd have to buy 10 balls at a time just to get the most out of the Premier Balls. They've lowered potions down to 22. Oh wait, they lowered Pokeballs in price too. Okay, so they lowered Pokeballs to 200. Oh no, to 100. And they lowered potions to 200 instead of 300. Antidote, I think, used to be 100? No, wait. I th yeah, I think Antidote used to be more expensive, actually. Or no, cheaper. I think Antidote used to be cheaper, so did they raise the price? I, I guess so. Whatever. Um, that's cool. Let's, um, let's get this bread, uh, as, the, as they, as they say. Um, I don't know what I'm actually want to do. I mean, I guess we'll come over here. You know, why not? Why not? Wait, what's up? What's up here? Might be a, might be a, might be an epic item. Nope, no item. Oh, wow, there is an item. It's just hidden. Okay, it's just a genuine hidden item. Tree looks like it can be chopped down. Well, that's for later. I like how I like how we're just not restricted to squares anymore either, man. It feels so good. Feels so good, man. Feels so good. Um, so let's just kick about over here. Route 22, man. I was hoping the the the, the colors would maybe change, depending on which route you went to. Maybe they maybe they will. But from what we've seen so far, they're the same. Oh, hey, Callum. Um, hoping to make the Pokemon League someday too. This is where the battle amongst the strongest trainers, uh, the ones that they call the Elite Four. I was hoping I could get a glimpse of them, but the guard at the gate wouldn't even let me pass without any badges for the Pokemon gyms. Guess I'll have to go the long way by battling and getting stronger. So Callum, I guess that means it's on. Wait, am I battling you again already? 
Ah, yeah. I mean, I should have expected that, to be honest. Okay. What's up, Luke? So, he's, a, he's got more Pokemon sense. He's got a Pidgey on his team. You know, as typical uh, rival fashion. And we get to throw our Pikachu into battle. Ayy. With his, with his little outfit on. Ah. Uh, guess we'll just hit him with a Thundershock. Since, uh, since we're here. Why not? <sighs> it feels so good to use a super effective attack. Like... I know I joke a lot about the super effective button and relax free for alls and free for alls and stuff. And for anybody that's new to my channel, or if there is anybody new to my channel, uh, and you don't understand what that is, you check out my relax free for alls. Those are, those are good fun, or my free for alls in general, Pokemon free for alls. Anyways, uh, speaking of that, um, I joke about the super effective button a lot, and it's you know people see uh, the word super effective and they just click it because it's so irresistible. That's that's how I'm feeling about this. I mean, I could probably quite easily destroy this Eevee with Thundershock. But Double Kick is just feeling extra nice. Because of the, the HD rumble on the Joy-Con, I can't wait to play this with the Pokeball Plus. I'm so excited. Um, Pidgey's level 5, hell yeah. Learn Gust, hell yeah. I'm gonna beat Trainer Luke. Whoa, seriously? Yeah, man. Let's pop in. Hmm, maybe battling uh, like this is just helping you get stronger, huh, Callum? Oh well, that works too. Uh, let's train hard so someday we both make it to the Pokemon League. I don't actually know who the champion is. I think it was Datamind and the champion theme was Datamind too. Oh, what's the, what's the Pikachu? Oh, if you like wave your Joy-Con. Yo, he's feisty! What's what's happening? Surf seems like he enjoys battling with Luke's Pokemon. Yo, he's he's feeling feisty, I, I, I reckon. Uh, hey man. I don't know how you feel me stroking you through the hat, but, you know, go off, I guess. And then, here, have have a berry. Last time I last time I tried feeding it, the Joy-Con was, was a bit weird. Because, like, it was aimed at the wrong direction, but now it seems to be fixed. So I think as long as you're aiming it in the center, like, when you, when you press, I guess when you press this button, wherever you're aiming it is where the center is. Yeah, okay, I just confirmed my theory. So, aim it in the middle like you would with the Pokeball, press A. And then you're you're perfectly centered. Cool. Anyways, enough enough partner play. It's a bit of a bit of a dodgy term, IMO, but you know, whatever, whatever, whatever. Oh, we can find Rattata's here. I wanted to see if we can find Mankeys here or something, but there's no Mankeys to be seen. Uh, a lot of the Pokemon catches, once I've already caught a Pokemon, if I'm catching any extra Pokemon, I'm probably gonna just do it off screen. Oh, so we do still have Pokeballs in the overworld. Five Pokeballs! Alright, cool. Um, yeah, if there's any, like, um, Pokemon I've caught before, like Rattatas and stuff. I'm, I'll most likely just cut those out. Like, I, I probably won't keep those in, unless I'm in the middle of talking about something. <gasps> Spearow! Hey, it's a new Pokemon. Come here, big boy. Come here, big boy. I like how you actually, you actually have to chase after them now. Like, that's added, like, a whole new element to the game that... I don't know. I think it's neat. I quite like it. Uh, so let's get ready. Yeet. Never have to catch a Pid uh, Pidgey. A Spearow again. Hate Spearow. Well... I don't, I don't hate it. Eh, it's alright. It's okay. Anyways. Got ourselves our first ever Spiro. Our first ever, uh, mini, our first ever mini Ho-Oh. Hey, Spiro, how's it going, buddy? Spiro's been added to your party. Please don't take him away. I don't want him on my party. I'm, I'm so happy that they've just made this game so convenient, by the way. The fact that they've just added, like, I just want to explore, man. I just want to explore. I'm sorry if I'm not, like, rushing through to get this playthrough done. I just, I really want to explore. I really like how they've done this, though. They've made it so, like, everything's just there. And you don't have to go talk to this specific person just to nickname your Pokemon. You can just do it. It should have always been that way, but it just wasn't. And I'm glad that they've changed it for that one. Like, just for the better, to be honest. They've made, they've made it so good. And I'm really, I'm really happy with it. Truly. Well, very, very truly happy with it. Uh, if you hear my voice cut out, it's because I'm recording these in bulk. And uh, I'm not I'm not used to recording videos in bulk. I used to record videos in bulk all the time when I was younger, but uh, I don't really do videos like that anymore. So uh, I'm a bit I'm a bit rusty. Uh, so if you do hear my voice cut out, then be please be patient with me. Can we just talk about the Pokedex animation as well? It is gorgeous. First ever Nidoran caught. I'm I am gonna try and get um every single Pokemon caught. Uh, what I really do want is to get a Mankey, but apparently I, I just can't find a Mankey. Uh, I don't know if Mankey's even found here in this part of the game anymore. I mean, I imagine it would be, but... I don't know. Spearow, Nidorina... Eh, I mean, I guess we could come back and have a look later. Uh, as for now, let's just continue on towards the Viridian Forest, you know? This is where a lot of people have already played the game. This is where a lot of uh, the demos have been shown off, though. So, 
I'll probably won't stick around in Viridian Forest too long. Apparently you can find Bulbasaurs in there though, and you can find like Charmanders and Mount Moon, which is really exciting. Uh, I guess we'll just have to wait and see. Oh, Rattata, don't care. Man, Pokemon Go has taught me to just catch everything I see. So uh, that's what I really want to do in this game. I just want to catch everything I see, but I know uh, just for the playthrough purpose, I should probably actually start ignoring some things. But like, because of how like how, how I've like been trained to just basically to gain experience in Pokemon Go, you the best way to do it is just to catch everything you see over and over and over and over and over. I, I, I've been trained to do that. Um, okay, they told me to use a berry. Sure, why not? Uh, let's get a ras... Oh, no, no, no. Let's get a raspberry on the on the go. Why not? Here you go, Caterpie. Uh, and then I guess... Okay, let's try Premier Balls. Let's use this. Okay, cool. Uh, and then we'll just... Yeet. Nice. Okay, cool. So the Caterpie should definitely stay in. Premier Ball Caterpie. Nice, nice. Oh man, Premier Balls are my favorite. I'm gonna save Premier Balls for my favorite type of Pokemon, I think. Because Premier Balls just look amazing. They look so they look so clean. I really want to use a, an Oddish on my team now because my Oddish is so high leveled. Uh Caterpie's data is allergic to Pokedex. Caterpie tucked away. Yeah, they don't even let you like nickname them from here with two, which is I mean I guess which is like convenient for speed. Uh we've got an, uh we've got a metapod here as well. Hey man, what's popping? Oh, we've only got one of these left. Okay, well, I'll, I'll, I'll go back to using Pokeballs now, anyway. Um, this one's gonna need a- okay, so this is like our first, like, yellow. He's like- ooh, hold on. This is like our first yellow circle Pokemon. I'm guessing it's just because he's in evolution, obviously, so he's a bit- bit- bit more feisty. Uh, okay, not quite an excellent throw. I've still got to work on my throwing, uh, but we'll get there eventually. There we go, we caught him, though. So I'm assuming because we caught an evolution, we should be rewarded with more, maybe? More experience? Um, yeah, by the looks of it, because I mean, a lot of my Pokemon leveled up, so, you know, hell yeah. Nidoran's level 4, Pidgey level 7, and that's our first Metapod. Don't really care, you're a Metapod. Um, Pidgey's kicking about. I guess we'll just explore the, the wood. oh god, okay. First battle. First battle of the woods. What's this guy's name? Let's see. Bugcatcher whom? Bugcatcher Rick. Um, Bugcatcher Rick. I, I really hate myself for doing that. I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry I subject that to you. I'm sorry I subjected you to that. I think this this would probably be my favorite Pokemon game ever if they decided uh, to um, like if they made if they made this but with every single Pokemon from generations one to eight. This would be my favorite Pokemon game ever. Because I love Kano and having having all like if, if there was like 800 Pokemon to catch in this game My god, I would I would have So much time to spend on this game And I know it's not feasible and it's you know, it's the first ever switch games I don't expect that of them But if they ever did make a game like this in the future with that many Pokemon man. Oh man <gasps> wild Pikachu. Oh, hey Hey little buddy It's another it's another Pikachu. Okay. That's kind of it. I mean, I, knew, I know Pikachu lives in uh, lives in Viridian Forest, but like that, that caught me off guard. I didn't know we'd be able to see one so soon, you know. Oh, okay. I didn't set my Pokeball properly. Sorry about that. Okay, there we go. That's much better. Awesome. Well, I guess we can get a Raichu now, <laughs> since you can't actually evolve your partner Pokemon, which is a bit daft to be honest, but understandable. All right, um, Pikachu caught, go away. Man, I'm gonna feel bad about releasing Pikachu. Uh, what's this, five Pokeballs? No, three, three raspberries, okay. So I'm quite, I'm quite liking the fact that you find like, oh wait, oh, it's a big, that's a big Weedle. Okay, that's a big Weedle, he's got a red aura around him. Apparently that means he's big. It'll say he's huge. Yep, it's huge. I don't know what, what be like what benefit that, that has. Like the Pokemon size. Okay, I'm throwing terribly, hold on. I don't know what benefit there is to that, but whatever. Epic. All right, we caught him quite easily. I mean, I'm sure them being big is makes them harder to catch. Um, and it, I don't know. I guess it gives you a bonus multiplier. I don't know, man. I, I, I've not really been keeping up with Let's Go Pikachu and Let's Go Eevee News that well. Uh, so other people probably can help you better with what it actually does. But I mean, I guess it just means it's a bigger Pokemon. You know? It's, oh, there's another red gl gl glowing aura up there. Is that a... Caterpie? What is that? Oh, it's another Weedle, I think. 
Yeah, okay. It's not a huge weedle. Whatever. Let's just get through Viridian Forest. Why do you walk so slowly? Hey, do you know if ba Bulbasaur... Hey, do you know Bulbasaur appear in this forest? Oh, okay. So she was just... Yeah, there you go. She just tells you the Bulbasaurs appear in this forest, which is pretty cool. I quite like that NPCs do that. Hopefully, uh, more NPCs... You know, like maybe in my... Uh, hopefully in a uh, rock tunnel, they're like, Hey, do you know that uh, Charmander are here? You know? It'd be pretty cool to get uh, tips from, like, you know, random people. Um... Just generic Thundershock for this one, I guess. I'm not actually sure how I'm going to take on Brock. I guess Double Kick Pikachu is just going to have to do it to him. It's pretty funny that they gave Double Kick to Pikachu. Just, just, basically just for, just for Onyx. I mean, I wouldn't say just for Onyx, but like, it is a way to get around it. Uh, they could have probably given Pikachu some other weird move, but Metapod. Don't really need to care about you because I've already got one. Uh, let's come up here, see if there's anything up this way. I wouldn't mind getting a Bulbasaur, can't lie, because obviously I want to I wanna catch them all, you know, I wouldn't mind getting a Bulbasaur. I do need one of everything. Um, a few Weedles, why are they so, why are all the Weedles big? Like, what the, what gives? Why are the Weedles big? Yeah, I wouldn't mind getting like a, a one of everything because I want to do all the Master Trainer stuff as well for my YouTube channel. Um, but obviously that's going to be later. Anyways, you're challenged by Bugcatcher Doug. Hey man, how's it going? Kakuna! All right, all right. You need to chill out with that, man. Uh, a little bit of thunder smash. It's level three. Why is it so low leveled? Man, why? Oh, what? Wait, how did it live? It's a level three Kakuna versus my level eleven Pikachu. I know Pikachu is typically like I think Pikachu is like mixed attacker, but like, how did it live? Especially against this, like Pikachu that tip that has. This Pikachu I'm using has higher stats than normal. Like, this Pikachu is a is a buffed Pikachu. I don't... Whatever. We're almost level 12 now. You can you can hear it. Focus energy. Bugcatcher Doug. Huh? I've got no other Pokemon to battle with. Yeah, because you just have one Kakuna for some reason. Wait, did I get three Pokeballs for winning that? That's so cool. Why did I never notice that before? Pidgey, go away. Okay, so there's some small Weedles now as well. Oh, wow, there's a male Pikachu. Hey, hey, male Pikachu. Man, there's so many, like, big Pokemon coming out to play. Good God, there's so many Pokemon, like, just running around. Let's catch this Pikachu. What's health do? Oh, oh, no, 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 thank you. I mean, it's pretty good that they have a health option there, though. That's that's awesome. Uh, let's use a Raspberry on this Pikachu, because it is, it is a yellow yellow bar. Need all the help that we can get. Uh, all right, let's... Epic. Okay, almost got an excellent on it. Need to just do the timing a bit better. But, you know, practice makes perfect. Hell yeah. Caught another Pikachu. Alright, I want to catch this Kakuna here just so I don't ever have to, like, bother evolving it, so... Let's do that. I'm, like, surrounded in Pokemon. It's so crazy, man. Excellent. Hey, okay. Getting the hang of it now. Getting the hang of it now. I just need to take my time. I think I'm just too rushy. I just I just rush. Oh my god! I raspberried. Excellent! What, what do you want from me? I don't think curveballs are really a thing in this game, so let's let's raspberry you, and then please stay in the ball this time, Kakuna. In Pokemon Go, Kakuna is always really mean to me as well, though, so I, I don't know why I expected. I really need some great balls. This Kakuna doesn't like me. Can it run away? I don't actually know if the wild Pokemon can run away or not. Uh, let's try and raspberry it again, though. This is the first time a Pokemon's given me issue, which is pretty dope, I guess. Uh, okay, let's do this. Please, Kakuna, be nice to me here. No excellent, but we're, uh... Please. 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 Oh my god. That, the Pokemon Go... The Pokemon Go side of me... Um... Thinks that when the Pokemon... You know, in, po in Pokemon Go, if you've ever played Pokemon Go before, you'll know that when it shakes three times, that's that means the Pokemon stayed in. Uh, because the... I don't know why, for some reason, three shakes and it's in, in Pokemon Go. Uh, not four. Uh, so whenever it shook three times, I thought I had it. Oh my god, you're such a troll. Kakuna, what is your issue? Come on, bro. I don't want- I don't want to spend uh, mo any more time on you. You're literally a Kakuna. Metapod was nice. This is why Butterfree's better than you. Please. I'm just- I'm so sick of this. I can't be bothered anymore. Imagine finding a shiny Kakuna and it just does this to you. Imagine.
Oh my god, finally. It wasn't on an excellent throw or anything, but we finally got him. Man, that was dumb. <laughs> I never want to see another Kakuna in my life. Unless it's shiny, then I'll take it. But yeah, basically what I'm, what I'm gathering from this game is you're going to want to make sure you're constantly stacked with Pokeballs. Because, uh... Look at all these Pokemon. Oh, I've got to sneak past. I've got to sneak past. I want to I wanna get out of here. I want to get out of here. Got another train in battle. Hey, there's a huge Kakuna up there. Kakuna gave me so much trouble as a normal sized one. I don't want to imagine what a huge Kakuna will do to me. Uh, that sounded wrong. Last Joycelyn, how's it going? What's popping? How's it, how you doing? Pidgey, okay. Simple stuff. All right, just getting out of here now. Um, hey, wait up, what's the hurry? Why the rush? Hey man, there's no hurry or rush. I just want to take on Brock already, bug catcher Sammy. What you got for me? A Metapod? Never seen one of those before. All right, I'm just gonna hit him with Thundershock because you know it's that's what we do out here. Hey man, the higher Pokemon CP is, the higher its combat power is. Your CP is a value made up of various stats and things combined. Yeah, CP is a bit of a confusing thing. Uh, confusing thing, and honestly, I, I I'm not sure if I if I like it very much. I mean, it's not. I don't know. I, I understand it a bit better in actual Pokemon Go, but I don't know how it works in Let's Go Pikachu and Levi. Um, just Oddish is all we're getting. Oddish, Caterpie. Nothing, nothing really different. Okay, cool. Whatever. Let's just let's just mosey on by and make our way up to Peter City. Uh, nice. Uh, I was hoping we'd run into each other. Luke, you're always here whenever I go. You know your Pokemon gym is up this way, right, Callum? You can battle against gym uh, trainer, gym leader there. He's a seriously strong trainer. If you want to get stronger, you've definitely got to take him on. Ha, ah, geez, sir, you're already on for a good battle too. Uh, who wouldn't be? All right then, you're making me want to shoot you guys on, so take these. Oh, five potions. Thank you very much, Luke. Very, very, very kind of you, my friendly rival. Uh, bought uh, some for you with the prize money I've been earning from my battles. Be the gym leader, Callum, and you'll call your, really call yourself a true trainer. Give it give it your best. Hey, man. I've got an Oddish and a Pikachu. I think, I think I'll do just fine. Um, let's see. I don't know. Should we take on Brock already? Or should we just save it for the third episode? Should I be... Should I... Should I... Should I... Should I cock tease y'all and save it for the third episode? I think that is actually what we're gonna do. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching the second uh, part of Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu. Uh, third episode, we're going to be taking on Brock. I hope you're looking forward to it, because I sure am. Um, as for now, we're going to go ahead and, uh, I guess we'll just check out our Pokemon before we wrap it up real quick. What, what's going on? Uh, party's looking nifty. Quite like the party. Bag. This is what I want to do. Uh, still got to get used to all this stuff, man. Uh, okay. And then we've got all these guys. Uh, Metapod level 6. Probably release some of the duplicates. Um, I guess I'll, I can just do that. I can just do that off screen. Oh yeah, one thing I want to look at is Pokemon following you. So we can move Oddish up to the front. And I think that means Oddish will follow us? Maybe? No? Maybe outside? I think Oddish maybe follow us outside. Let's have a look. Okay. I don't know how to make it happen. Uh, I know you can make Pokemon follow you though. So let's see. Uh, take a uh, ball. Okay, here we go. Oddish will now travel alongside you. Hell yeah. So the first Pokemon we caught is now following us around with Pikachu on our shoulders as well. That's so cool, man. Pokemon following you. Uh, I mean, I've, I've been harsh on it in the past. I've been I've been very harsh on the feature in the past. I was always very like, uh, it's a, it's a bit of a daft feature. Why does it matter? It is so pleasing, to, especially in 3D at least, to see your Pokemon following behind you. And oh my god, that Geodude looks so cool in the overworld. And there's a Butterfree up there. This is the Pokemon world. This is how Pokemon should be. And honestly, I cannot wait. Oh, Oddish just found something. I, I honestly, I, I cannot wait to to see that. I really, I really cannot wait to see Gen 8. And I really hope that this series continues uh, to happen. I hope there's Let's Go Johto. Let's Go Hoenn. Let's Go Sinnoh. I want Let's Go Everything. I, I love this so far. I know I've not finished the game, but from what I've what I've gathered, this is really fun. It's really simple. Something you can pick up and just play and relax. It's it's not serious, man. It's fun. It's it's good old Pokemon. Just the the way it was. Because honestly, Pokemon has added a lot of stuff uh, that has made the game really hard for like newcomers to get into. Like there's so many moves now and so many abilities. So I kind of like the 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 con the condensed down version. You know, it's it's neat. 
Anyways, I'm done rambling here. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for listening. If you are enjoying that, like is appreciated. You already know. And uh, stay tuned to my channel. I'm going to be uploading more of these today. And basically until I'm done. So if you're enjoying them, then let me know in the comments. Let me know by liking the video. And uh, I'll see you guys next time.